The, the biggest part about this year is um, just having a team that's going to be around for um, the entire season. So one of the big things that we did look at is contract-wise, how we do keep the players here. So everybody's got a, a buyout that I feel will be pretty much keep the whole team together. Um, that being said, um, obviously we want to improve on last year's things. I think this year's team is going to be a lot younger. Um, I don't think we're going to be uh, have the go-to guys that other teams might have, but I think that the key part that I want to focus on is playing our style of basketball, which is playing up-tempo and playing aggressively. I, I think we've always been more successful when we played up-tempo. I, I, I felt when we, we, we brought in players that were available, you know, I thought um, Morakinho was great for us, but I've never ever played with a big, so it was a little bit trying to adjust to, to accommodate him also. Um, so this year, uh, we're probably not going to have a natural center, so we'll go back to, to the successful group when we had um, probably Gerald Robinson, who was a, um, a foreman, and, and Jordan Williams. We'll have players that are probably not as experienced and as, uh, as they are, but we'll have players that are kind of like similar size that allow us to get out and run. I think it's great. I think it gives an opportunity. Not everybody's going to win the cup. But uh, sometimes in the past, you could have had your season over in a, in a shorter period of time. I think this allows teams to make the adjustments. If we need to make changes before the league um, commences, we'll have that time now in order to make the changes. So I guess the cup competition is going to be very, very important. But players have, you know, are going to have to prove themselves in that time frame. Um, I've always said that, you know, um, the name of the club is always more important than the individuals that might coach it and play for the team. But it's great to know that clubs stick, um, the fans stick with us because last year was painful. Um, you know, I've always said it was, um, uh, I think until somebody walks in a coach's shoes, they probably don't understand how painful it is for the coach or frustrating or, and so forth and everything that goes on. But, you know, I want to make, you know, I want to reward the fans because they've remained we're totally faithful and committed to this franchise, so um, let's just enjoy it and have fun together.